All right, so today we'll be featuring the top six charge controllers available on the market today. Uh, this is, of course, in our opinion, these are the controllers that, controllers that we carry here at Solar Specialist. So let's jump right into it. All right, so first up, we have the C-Series uh, by Schneider Electric. Right here, we have the C35, the C40, and the C60. And all that means, really, is the C35, it's a 35 amp charge controller. The C40 is a, is a 40 amp charge controller. And the C60 is a 60 amp charge controller. These are what you would call a pulse width modulated charge controller, PWM for short. And these are your, it's, 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 it's really your first generation of charge controllers. These have been around for a very long time. And uh, they're very reliable and they're also inexpensive. So if you're gonna do a small project, let's say about 1500 watts, if you that would be about six 250 watt uh, solar panels, up to maybe 270 watt without overloading the charge controller, then you could go with a C60. If you're gonna go say maybe a thousand watts, then you could go with a C40. Now the C40 is the only one in this series that actually gives you a 48 volt setting. And what that means is that you can uh, use this for a 12 volt, a 24 volt, or a 48 volt solar system. Uh, in 48 volts, you'll be able to fit up to 2,000 watts of charge on this charge controller, okay? Of solar panels, sorry, on this charge controller. Now, the C-Series is really our, it's the most sold charge controller. This, this controller sells a lot. We've sold hundreds and hundreds of these over the years, and uh, they really are reliable. However, they, they, there are other options when it comes to efficiency where you can get better charging from, from, from the same amount of panels, from the same array. Now, one of the cool things about the C-Series is this accessory right here. This usually goes for about 100 US dollars. This accessory allows you to basically view all the settings of uh, your performance on the charge controller. You're able to view your watts, you're able to view your battery, the, the battery bank voltage, amp hours generated over a set amount of time, amp hours generated over the life of the charge controller. And uh, you are also able to see the current or, or the amperage that the panels are pushing. So from here, you're able to figure out how many watts your um, compared to what you're using you can compare to, to, to what you're you're generating and it's good to always know the stats of your your system basically the cool thing about this is your system can be in another location you can have this device inside your house comes with a 50 foot card and the system can be elsewhere and you put this in the house and you're able to know what's going on without having to go outside or, or go elsewhere to, 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 to actually view the system. You're able to, it's like a remote display basically for your C-series charge controllers. Uh, definitely recommended. This is a must have on your system. Otherwise you're kind of in the dark. Uh, you you want to know exactly what you're generating uh, and that, that way you're able to gauge your load I know okay you know today is not so sunny I might want to plug something out instead of you know running your system all the way down before you, you, you it shuts down another cool aspect or feature of the C series as well is if you notice it says charge slash load controller what that means is if you have a wind turbine then uh, in high winds you would want to be able to dump the excess power that's coming from the wind turbine. So th this allows you to redirect that excess power to, you can divert it to a load or you can divert it to just a dump load which will basically burn off the excess uh, energy instead of overcharging and damaging your battery subsequently, okay? so. So these are perfect for small scale system, uh, you know, within about 1500 watts. 
if you're going to go with a larger system then you'll need a larger capacity charge controller okay so up next in the schneider line of products we have the xw mpbt 60 150 now this charge controller MPPT unit. What that means is that it's a maximum power point tracking charge controller and what that simply means is that it's a much more efficient charge controller. You get almost all the watts that you're generating from your solar panels. So these I have proven myself if we have 2000 watts of panels in the right solar in the right condition you'll realize that you're getting your 2000 watts from your panels so for efficiency for large scale design as well this 150 means that you are able to wire your panels up to 150 volts dc and the mppt will then cut it back down to your nominal voltage on your battery bank in some of our videos you'll see we we have five six seven eight of these charge controllers on one system what 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 one of the cool thing things about this product is that you're able to tie everything in and sync all the charge controllers and have them operate as one unit so you can have multiple charge controllers and well, once you wire it all up you're able to to configure them as one single charge controller and it shows you what you're generating uh, overall as a single system basically so very very cool product another uh, feature i like with it is uh, when you're using the schneider electric inverters you're able to sync them as one and you have them on one interface so inside your home you can you can have a, a, a display device called the scp the system control panel and you're able to scroll through and change any setting in your control or any setting in your inverter it's it's a huge amount of data so i highly recommend uh once you're doing a certain size system like say you're doing maybe a six kilowatt system or a 10 kilowatt a 12 kilowatt system uh we normally go fully schneider that way everything is on one interface and you have a lot more control of the products with a, with a single device you know and you can have your interface elsewhere in the house uh, up to about 100 feet from the actual system so love these products i'm a schneider guy uh, personally i just simply i just prefer their products it's just a personal thing uh, it's one of the best solar products on the market today, globally. And uh, talking about favorites, here we have another one of my favorite manufacturers. This is Outback. And for you guys doing your research, you're gonna see a couple of names, Schneider being one of them, Outback being another. You might see Midnight Solar or maybe Magnum. Now those are all top of the line products. Really, I wouldn't be able to say which one is, is better than the other. They're all very good products and they're usually within the same price range. So uh, it all depends on your personal preference. Uh, I love Outback products because they are simple. Um, simple to set up. The, the, the menu is very straightforward and it has a, a lot of features and has the features that, that we as installer um, need such as uh, being able to program an automatic transfer switch from your charge controller and set all your parameters and, and stuff very efficient as well top of the line product uh, it comes in the flex max 60 and the flex max 80 so these are both the same charge controller but as you can see one is larger than the other this one is the 60 amp this is the 80 amp These are also maximum power point tracking charge controllers. So on your 60 amp, you'll be able to fit approximately 3000 watts of solar. You'll be able to fit approximately 4000 watts on the 80 amp. All right, you're, able, you're also able to wire in high voltage up to 150 volts DC and the charge controller will efficiently reduce, or, or should I say, cut the voltage back down to 
your nominal battery voltage, you know, for your 24 volt or your 48 volt battery bank uh, without losing any of that power in the process. And last but certainly not least, we have the 96 amp midnight charge controller, arguably the most sophisticated controller on the market. Uh, this charge controller comes with a lot of different features uh, that us as installers can appreciate. Um, so it really depends on, on what your preference is. Also an MPPT charge controller, very, very, very efficient unit. It's also very efficient for wind turbines as well. This unit being a 96 amp means that in 48 volts, you'll be able to put at least approximately 4,500 watts of solar. So if that means if you're using 300 watt panels, you'll be able to fit about 15 of them on this charge controller. And uh, like I said, it's an MPPT unit. So extremely efficient unit. Very happy. I, I, I love using this controller as well. It's, a, it's an intelligent unit. It logs a lot of data uh, from the moment it's, it's hooked up. Um, very programmable. It's compact and it handles load very well. I sell a lot of these. We, we have a lot of them in the field working for many years now. And uh, I can't say enough good things about the Midnight Classic. So if, if it is that you're looking for a large unit that can handle you know, up to 4,500 watts, definitely a good option. Now, just a, a pointer in case you don't know, you're able to have more than one charge controllers on a single solar system. So you, know, you can have multiple of these and wire them in, configure it, have them synced and configure it as one charge controller as well. So really cool product love it what i think is awesome among these manufacturers that are on top of their game is that they provide real solutions for the guys that are out in the field now one of the things i really appreciate with midnight solar is this charge controller is available in a 150 volt dc and a 200 volt dc version so what that means is for instance say your 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 array is gonna be a good distance away say 100 or even more than 100 feet away from your actual system what you'd want to do is you would want to wire that in a high voltage in order to, to capitalize uh to get the maximum efficiency so you'll send that in a high voltage to your to your charge controller and then your charge controller will be able to take that 200 uh, volt and and convert it back down to 48 volts for your battery bank and that will charge your battery bank in just about any lighting condition so awesome charge controller midnight solar you guys do a very good job for more information on these products you can give us a call at 876-467-6643 or check out our website solarspecialistja.com we're here in jamaica located in junction saint elizabeth we're island wide we install all over the island and you are able to follow us online and see some of the great work that we do. Once again, solarspecialistja.com. All right, so that's it for our review, guys. If you find this information helpful, please comment below. Let us know what you're thinking. If you have a question about any one of these charge controllers, please don't hesitate. You can always comment below. If you haven't done so as yet, Go ahead and subscribe to our channel. Just hit that subscribe button. You can hit the bell so that you're notified whenever we upload new videos. Uh, thanks a lot for the guys that are following us. We really, really, really appreciate you. Once again, one love.